This is a tutorial on how to submit a paper for a Turnitin assignment on Moodle on your iPad. You must have the Google Drive app on your iPad and a Google Drive account. If you have a Gmail email address, either for Gmail itself or for an SCA student's account, then you automatically have a Google Drive. The first thing you need to do is go to the paper that you have in pages that you need to submit. When you have your paper open, hit the export button, which is the box and the arrow at the top of the screen. Choose to open in another app. And also choose PDF as your format. You'll then be given a choice of which app to open. Find Google Drive on your list of apps and click Copy to Drive. It will give you confirmation that it has saved it to your drive. Make sure that you hit Save and then you will see it uploaded to your drive. Then switch over to your Moodle account and log in. Go to the class that you need to submit a paper for and then find the actual assignment which will have the blue page with the red arrow wrapped around it. Click on the assignment. And once the assignment has loaded, find the submit paper that has the cloud and the arrow symbol at the bottom of the turn in box. You'll need to put a submission title in here. You can put rough draft, final draft, or whatever your teacher asks you to put in here. Then in the submission box, which is the box with the blue arrow in it, hit the white square at the top left corner that has the page with the plus on it. You'll then be given some options on where to pick a file from. Choose SCA Students Google Drive and then log into your account using your credentials. This will be your email address and your password for your email. Then you'll see all the files from your Google Drive account. Find the paper that you would like to submit and click select this file. Then click add submission. Once you've done this, you'll get confirmation that your paper has been submitted and within 15 to 45 minutes, you'll receive a originality report giving you a percentage of what part of your paper could be similar. Your teacher will give you more information about similarity and how that percentage may or may not impact your class grade. 